Doctor of Pharmacy program in Manitoba, I would say, is one of the most current and contemporary program in Canada. Uh, we prepare our graduates to be practice ready, uh, to work within collaborative teams, and to provide care not only to Manitobans and Canadians within urban cities and rural communities, but also in northern areas where healthcare can be quite different and the demands for pharmacists and their role can be quite different. When we think of patient care, uh, no health professional works in silos. To really provide the best patient care, we need to have integrated collaborative patient care uh, practices. And so we're very fortunate at the University of Manitoba where pharmacy, uh, along with uh, medicine, nursing, dentistry, and rehabilitation sciences, works together. There's a ton of student research opportunities available here at the College of Pharmacy, whether you want to do more qualitative or quantitative work in a lab or work with data. Um, throughout your program, you have opportunities to take part in a summer research program where your entire summer is dedicated and funded towards a single research project. There's a lot of support available and I think a lot of that comes from the, the size of our college. Uh, relative to other colleges in the country, we're, we're fairly small and close-knit, which means we've got excellent support staff in our administrative office. We've got the associate dean and dean having town halls with students to hear their concerns, to give them updates on how things are going and where things are going. And then there are, are things uh, as simple as professors opening their doors and making sure, and now that we're in a, a physical space, to actually open doors. It's, it's really exciting that students can just come by. One of the things we've really worked together in the last couple of years is really creating clinical rotations that are collaborative. So for example, uh, we actually send students together from different health disciplines to one of the First Nations communities where they learn to work together in practice. I think the culture that, that we have, being a relatively small but expanding community, we, we really know each other and I think it's very easy to be inspired by each other when someone down the hall is doing something. Why I chose to study pharmacy here at the U of M was primarily because of its small environment which really provides opportunities for meaningful mentorship throughout your program. So when you find an area that you really love, the college is here to support you and connect you with people, whether it be pharmacists within the province or within the country to meet your own um, educational goals. And now in my last year of pharmacy, looking back, the University of Manitoba has been able to provide me with kind of finding my three main passions, education, um, leadership, and advocacy. There are a ton of opportunities for, for graduating pharmacists. There's a, going to be a good number that are going to gravitate towards the world of community pharmacy where you have that frequent and essential contact with day-to-day -day patients, hospital pharmacy, many realms within that from general medicine to surgical wards, cardiology, ICU. Primary care is an ever-expanding place where pharmacists are finding themselves. We have a lot of pharmacists in team-based care in, in primary care, and that's just the clinical aspect. Some pharmacists are going to go into academia, policy, decision-making, and those types of things.